Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome, welcome, welcome to Euro Truck Simulator 2. See we're here, we're in the beginning page thing, aren't we? Um Yeah, so here I have my profiles. I have my old pro mod profile, my current one that I use at the moment, my old old TSM one, and my research profile. See this one here? This one's new, which you can see. Level zero, distance driven is five mile because I've just done like two deliveries. This is because, see, hungry man, did you see that? Well, you'll see it soon. Now, just brace yourself because this is immense. Look at that! Oh my god! It's oh. It's a new map, it's the Hungry Map, zero version, not zero, not, not point nine, isn't it? Yeah. And the map makers, uh, well, this is a new map. And uh, it's so detailed, look at that, oh my god, I mean, that, <laughs> that's something, isn't it, that, come on. Guess how many is here, or how many are going to make? This is just this little area here to start with. I wonder if that's the tools that they use, and they click and drag them in. I bet it is, honestly. I seriously think that's what that is there. It's like the little tools they use when they're clicking and dragging and making the map thing. Anyway. Around 300 towns and cities are going to be developed onto this, which is going to take some time. I don't know how many there is now. There's a good... There's at least 50 that are accessible, maybe. Anyway. Link will be in the description for this download. 0 0.9 might be updated when this video goes out. I'm doing it a couple of weeks early. However, there you go. We're gonna drive today, obviously. So uh, you have to create a new profile when doing this. Um, I'm gonna link you to a video like I did with the Pro Mod one, showing how to install it and whatever. It's not that hard, so you should understand it. I did. It works with mods, but it doesn't work with the in-game SCS map, you know, the just the one that, you know, the Europe one. So you have, it's a, I think, is it a module or something? I don't know. Now you have to select and it selects the hungry one. There you go. Doesn't work with Pro Mod, doesn't work with TSM, doesn't work with any other map. It's a standalone map. It works with mods, however, so, you know, it's a good thing. Where are we going to drive though? Oh where? Mercedes there. I'm going to take and scan you. How many miles is that? Shall we go down there? Yeah. Game crashed. No. There you go. Frank 007. I have new mail. Anybody? Get lost. I haven't bought my own truck. What truck is this? R500. Okay. Okay, so I want to show you something. Let's get in the cab. Look at the vegetation in here. And the people, look at the people as well. That's quite cool. Um Yeah. What's to say about this? Highly detailed. And start with these people. I want to see if that's good. It just clips through the look at the look at the person. Ah! Yeah. 
speak to my man. Maybe you may know him. Oh, I'm playing neutral as well. Okay. So, first thing about this, there is no motorways. I haven't seen any motorways yet. All this seems to be is just like country roads, which I love. I love a challenge. Some of these roads are actually quite challenging. Um, and that and 300,000 cities. I don't think there's even that many in Pro Mod. And the other thing. And it's more squashed, squashed together as this. Though the mileage, you know the mileage, see, 53 miles there, see, let's just go a little bit. It's gone down one mile. It was 53 miles from the depot. See how it's not going down really fast? It's got correct distance on it. How, like, you know, any other map. Like, that bridge in Europe that we went across in one video, I don't know. It was like, to the game, it was a 10 mile long bridge. And there is no bridge in this world 10 mile long. So, you know, it's pretty stupid. I have new mail, yes, bog off. So yeah, lots of vegetation, mileage seems to be okay. Um, it's, it's actually it's real. It's visually appealing. If I showed you promo now, you'd probably pick this. And I'm probably going to make a series out of this too. The hunger receives. It, I don't know. This is the first look. Oh wow! What's that? That's a problem. With these tight corners, trucks do cut, the trailers do cut. I was uh, I was driving down to where we've just set off from, and a uh, a truck had clipped a car because the trailer was coming around the corner, so it caused a bit of a uh, traffic jam. Yeah, that's that. It wor mods work all like tr well. See the mods that I have in the pro mod file, apart from the pro mod, work on here. I've got all the ones that I have on the pro mod enabled on here. So that's... Oh, I've turned the engine off. Idiot. Keep going. So yeah, that's a good thing. And what else does it say about it? It's beautiful. Oh, look! Oh! See that thing running across the road then? The hell was that? Did you see? There was like a squirrel or something that run ran across the. Wow. It's <laughs> quite cool. That that's something SCS need to uh, implement as well, like animals and people, just on the road. But make them solid so you can hit them. I don't know that sounds awful, but make sure you can hit them and run them over. It probably like a trucking style GTA, wouldn't it? See, look, all these little villages here. I'm gonna switch the thing to kil kilometers. What do you want? Drivers with qu Dorog. <laughs> ah, ba, 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 ba. Options, controls maybe. Adaptive automatic transmission. Don't know what that is. Um, gameplay, there we go. Um, use miles, get rid of the U. 
speed we're going now. Because it's it's a it's European. It's going to be in com kilometers, isn't it? There's actually I think there's one city on here that's only in the um, going east DLC or the pro mod. What is this? I mean, I'm fed up with like on S on just Euro Truck Simulator 2, just like with the wheel just going, keeping the truck straight on the motorway. With this, you actually have to turn the wheel. <laughs> so you're always on your toes. On your to you're always eyes open. Yeah, on your toes. I, I don't know. Really nice. Of course, I will still be on Pro Mod because I love that so much. There's like there's little bits in that. See, ooh, whoa, oh, <laughs> that's why you don't go fast around the bend. See, I these outdoor cafes. Something you don't see in Euro Truck Simulator 2 normal. Oh, I'm going back. Where dirty is that trailer? Mmm, chocolate biscuits. No, it's a dirty trailer. So you've got all these little shops and whatever. It's, it's cool. It really is cool. And you've got all this vegetation. I think there's only certain areas where there's dual carriageway. See, <laughs> them trailers are going to be a hassle. Um, have you already got this map? If you've got Euro Truck Simulator 2, are you downloading it now? Because, oh my. You have to create a new profile, you cannot you cannot add it to um, an existing one with pro mod or anything. It has to be fresh, new. You can add a research profile to it. No, hang on. No, you can't. You'd have to use Cheat Engine and do it yourself. You wouldn't be able to use a pr research profile unless someone's already done it on this map. Because research profiles generally add gar garages and stuff from the original Euro Truck Simulator 2 map. What's going on? Oh, it's a building site. Not crashed here or anything, are we? No. Just waiting for the lights to change. Come on. Wow, look at this. What's this? Zambek. I'm not even going to pronounce these Hungarian words because I'll just get. I'll just get them wrong. Put it that way. I was just gonna get bullied. Who's gonna bully me for <laughs> pronouncing things wrong? It wouldn't surprise me though. There is some nasty bastards in this world. Why have you got your lights on, dude? Turn them off. So you've got all these different shops here. Imagine if you. Well, in fact, that is a shop. Well, shop front. That's the delivery point. That's cool. See, the, the, I cannot talk. I'm going to take a drink. <sighs> Ice cold. The delivery points are all spread out. Unlike, say, 
Sheffield and Eurotruck. They're all tightly packed together apart from like the Rayburn or the is it the Acres or um, John Deere, the farm, the the farm one anyway, or the logging factory. That's just pushed a little bit away from the um, town centre, or city centre. But yeah, these seem to be all spread apart now. Is it BASF or BASF? Something like that. And you've got the garage there. And then you've got this here that's pushed away from like the rest of it. And the the, the delivery points have actually changed. You actually have to drive around some stuff. Like there was one. He wanted parking in a really weird position. And you had to like swerve around a pile of crates. It's pretty cool. Going for the overtake, that van. So I'm doing that little clicky thing there, but it's. Oh, hang on. Is this a motorway? Am I wrong? It might be a dual carriageway. But yeah, there's little motorways. Oh, he's come a cropper. Uh, realistic physics works with it as well, which is good. I have realistic physics seven, is it? Okay, so there might be a motorway, there might just be one motorway. Yeah, there's nothing that special. Ooh! I can see you coming with the uh, crone profi hoppers. Are they the profi hoppers? It's one of the mowers of Farming Simulator 2013. Got bits of grass sticking through the road. That's just map problems. They might fix that in the updates. It's in 0.9. It's very early well not I don't say very early alpha. I mean it's been released to the public and everything, but it's still in early stages of map creating. This is one of the first, if not the first publicly fully released map. And I don't know how often they're going to release updates or how Oh, well, how much are they going to add every update? Hopefully they're going to add quite a bit. I mean, I wouldn't want to see a city every single update, because that would be like another 200 updates. That's not going to happen. But I'm sure the Hungarian people who have made this are working on it right now. Depending on, it's like... It's 20 past 11 at night, so maybe not. They might be in bed, but... Unless they're doing an all-nighter, but... You know what I mean. They'll be working on it all the time. When they have free time, if they if, it's, if they have a job or they're in school, depending how old they are. When they have free time away from things like that, they will be making this. Come on. I overtake this uh, guy. Now we'll uh, get back onto the um, country roads. Let's see. No, can't do. Get out of my mirror. Sorry, I'm gonna have to pull in. Definitely seen new trailers anyway. I think these might be the Jazzy Cat ones. Okay. 
52 kilometers, not far. It's working about a kilometer a minute. And these are not real minutes, by the way, but they are. It does, it feels different, it really does feel different. I mean, I even saw a helicopter earlier. I think you, no, I don't think it was on the video. Look at that, what's that there? Something. But yeah. Ah, that's another problem. See those question marks there? There's, there's like, it's a coding error, I think. Obviously it'll be some special character and the game's not understanding it. So it's putting a question mark there asking, what's this, why, well, you know, something's here, I don't understand it. Just slams that question mark there. That might have to be something to do with the map script. Again, the, the map's in early stages of creation, so what do you expect really? I mean, I don't expect much. I've I saw it on a video, and I thought, hmm, this is going to be lame. Looking at the version, I thought, this is going to be absolute crap. And I love it. I love it as, like, the same as Pro Mod, maybe a little bit more. Because of that, because if you watch the, I think it was the Pro Mod, yeah, it was the Pro Mod video. How I said, I like the challenge of like small roundabouts, like small tiny roads and having to work out how to get the truck around it. It's like scan your truck's driving simulator all over again. And I like the fact you've got to think. I mean I hate thinking. So yeah, it's stuff like that. What's that? That's that's something I like about this map. You've got these, like with those with the AI trucks cutting across the lane. How I prevent, like, well, not prevent, but how I try not to do that. I try to prevent that happening by taking the corner. Well, it wouldn't be wide. Yeah, well, it would be wide to start with. No, it wouldn't. Yeah, it, oh, I don't know. Yeah, it, it would be wide. You go to the. You drive towards the crash barrier, put it that way, you work it out. <sighs> so, yeah, there is dual carriageway driving. I'm not bothered really. Because sooner or later you are going to have to turn off because the delivery point won't be smack next to the the you know dual carriageway or the dual carriageway shouldn't or I don't think it would drive into the town it'd be a little road again and it'd probably all weavy and it'd start to meander so you've got that driving element again If SCS could do that, I mean, there's little back alleys on this as well that you have to sometimes reverse down. I mean, I don't know what the delivery point is going to be here. Marton Vazar. Uh, destination. Um, Zekezv. Do I even want to pronounce these? I mean, I don't know how long these map makers have been working on this, and judging by all the release notes I looked at, I don't think you'd be able to speak to them in English. I think they're um, they're Hungarian. They don't speak English. They might, but you you, you never know. I wonder if like other people from different countries, like Hungarians pronounce our city's words like London that's pretty easy it's the cap it's one of the like most popular cities in the world 
yeah. Like Sheffield, would they say Sheffield? Or would they pronounce it with their words, dialect, accent, one of those? Can you tell them? Absolutely stupid. Welcome to my slice of YouTube. I play games, I talk a bit, I talk a lot sometimes. And yeah, I just... Oh, I vlog too! Yay! Oh, I can't believe I, like, seduce myself to do that. Vlog. Who would have thought an ugly fucker like me would do that? Come on, car! <laughs> Thank you. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, calm down. Right, there we go. It actually, feels like you're driving down some motorway in the UK on a uh, Euro Truck Simulator. Oh, I, guess, I keep saying Euro Truck like it's a completely different game. We're going to say Euro Truck, referring to the vanilla map. Let's say. So yeah, driving on the motorways there, it doesn't feel like you're driving on the motorway, it just feels... It's got something to it. And I can't put my finger on it, really. This is a quite a long drive. If I were going to make a series out of this... Um, I don't know how many days a week it would be on or how many like times a, a week oh, pff, how many times how many times a month or whatever <laughs> oh oh shh sh sh <laughs> oh my god what did i hit oh my Oh, what the hell did I hit? There's no other car unless it gone through the map. I was pulling into this lane here and it's like I hit something at the side of me. But that car went flying across the... I don't know. Oh, I, oh hang on. That might be a little... And you remember I was talking about... You should have watched the Pro Mod video. I'm referring to that again. I said in the Pro Mod video video that there's a lane on one of the roads that has like a sprite there and basically that sprite it's like a invisible block and you hit it and it's solid but it covers one lane it doesn't co cover the full carriageway like either south th southbound or northbound so say if you've got three lanes it'd only cover one of those lanes and I think that's what might have happened there. Because it just threw me across the carriageway and made me hit that car. Oh, I don't know. I'm running out of water. I've been talking that much. I need some kind of like water fountain. Yeah, let's put some uh, damage on the trailer. Shit. And the truck, because it's not even mine. Oh, I'm not going to get paid for this. Oh, balls. <laughs> oh, well. What can you do? I mean, my, uh, I like the Scania. I like DAF as well. I like, I like, I've said this millions of times. If my vehicles were going to go top to bottom in Euro Truck, it'd go Scania, Volvo, 
daff man emming in iveco no daff mercedes or um majestic man iveco and uh, dirty Renault. If um, if it was going to be IRL, meaning what have I drove, the only one would be DAF because that's the only truck I've ever drove. Um. Oh my! Did see? Did you see it there? Look, I was just. Oh, thank God it's done no damage. See there? I was just. See if we can find it. Where is it? I'm sorry. There. Right there. Oh, that might be that car there. Oh my. Oh, it's there as well. Hold on. Are you even going to be able to cross here? Road cut off. Wait a minute. No, we can still go into this map. Oh no! Can I get out of the way? Sorry. Okay, so you can't drive there. Can you get down here? No! It's blocked! Oh yeah, he can get through. Yeah. Motherfuck. Shit! Absolute dog shit! <laughs> How am I meant to do this? This might, map might be unplayable. If... You know... If things like that are happening. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. <laughs> oh my. Um, what am I gonna do? wedged on that truck. I know what. In fact, that's not going to work, is it? I'll let the, uh... Shut up. I thought the Volvo go past. I'm gonna go up the highway, get off, and then we'll have to go around. Oh, it's only there as well. I if I can get to the. No. I better just turn back. Now you get past me, sir. Oh. Better for me. You're gonna come past. Past. Come on. Come on. I know you want to. I'm hitting you now. Oh. Oh. Yeah. No. Yeah. Well. Can I drive through there? Let's try. No.
kidding me? Oh, that, that was bad. Jack knifed it. into the back of me, it's okay. Dick. What if I can call the assistant? Where would that take us? <laughs> no, 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 that's good. It's, where is it? Okay, where's the service station? That's good and all. Am I missing something here? Ah, it's there. No problem. We we'll have to call you, aren't we? Ah, oh, son of a gun! Oh, I can't believe that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I can. Um, Find that out. Uh, find the map maker. Try and contact them. Right. Oh, you're not going to take me back on there, are you? I swear to God. What the hell? See, oh, it was that sprite again, but that was covering the whole carriageway. I wonder if that's something they've took out. I wonder if there has been a. Uh, more of this thing before and it's basically just like a wall to stop people from going into the developing area oh well that was something wasn't it I've knackered the truck Knack of the trailer. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh, dirty Reynolds. <sighs> so obviously the cars can go through it because they're not a solid object to anything on the map. <sighs> Jesus. Better not happen again. Oh, well. Everything was going well, and I forgot what I was talking about. Even if it, I don't think it even mattered, did it really? What things that I do talk about matter? What things that I do talk about matter? That doesn't make sense. What things that I talk about really matter? There you go, English. <sighs> okay, so far on, okay on this road. So it it must just be there. Surely the when it's in the map editor they can see it look at this road here my delivery point's down there let's see it better when we go onto this road Drive down there. Who? Sign. Centrum. Centrum. <laughs> oh, snowplow. Right, we have to go down there somewhere. 
on that road there and down there and turn into the delivery point. So that's oh, that big building there's the uh, warehouse. Okay, and oh, it's this one. There doesn't seem to be traffic lights, many traffic lights and all. Flying around that corner, didn't you? Majestic. Oh, oh you're letting me go. Cheers. Um. That guy there just greeting people in. Like a bouncer on the door of a nightclub. Like, saying, Oh, you can come in, oh, you, no, you can fuck off. <laughs> you're not allowed in, you attacked someone last week. Do you remember? No, you was pissed out of your head, that's why. Yeah. I wonder if I could have just gone down the banking. Uh, no, I'll not try that. I'll tip the truck truck over then. Imagine that, just what's down here? Looks like a bit of a drop. I don't know if I want to try that. Oh I can feel the truck going. I can't believe that. this realistically and not run oh my god you look like a clown like a a clown ape because he was like Wah! throwing his hands up in there I just did the impression then but you couldn't see my arms Zero XP, zero money. Oh well, there you go. I showed you what this map was all about. Uh, I'm not annoyed really. It's it's something you find in early stages of things. I mean, if I found that in the vanilla game, I would be pissed. I really would be. But because it's that, I'm going to let it slide. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that's off me off my soapbox. <laughs> um, go get this map. It's good, apart from things like that, it will change, I can assure you. I mean, I haven't spoke to the map creators, but I know somewhere they're going to carry on with this, and it's going to change. There will be more updates to come, I hope. Anyway, thank you for watching. Please like, favourite and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye!